Welcome back guys, it's TGR, that's Gaming Robbo. Today guys we're going to be looking through the Hidden Gems list from Slovakia on Championship Manager 0102. Just before we do start the video guys, if any of you do use Facebook or Twitter, give us a like and a follow. And if any of you are new, subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell as well. But apart from that, let's start the show. Let's see the hidden gems from Slovakia on Championship Manager 0102. So guys, as I said before, we're going to be looking through the hidden gems from Slovakia. Now, just before we do start the video, please make sure if any of you are new, smash a like on the video and of course, subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell as well, so you know when our latest videos has been uploaded to our channel, guys. But apart from that, let's look at the first player from my hidden gems list from Slovakia, and my first goal, my first player is my goalkeeper, Branislav Zesto. Now Branislav, he's playing over at Zelina. He's 25 years old. Obviously, he's already had one Slovakian cap already, but he's valued at 375,000 pounds. He's getting paid £7,000 a week. Now, Branislav's potential ability is 150. He's going to be a really good goalkeeper for the Slovakian national team. But Branislav, as I mentioned, he's my goalie. So let's look at my fullback, starting at left back. Vladimir Labant. Now, Vladimir is 27 years old. He's already obviously made a name for himself within the Slovakian team. But he's playing over at West Ham. He's valued at £10 million. He's getting paid £65,000 a week. But he does have a relegation release clause of £7 million. Now with West Ham, they are one of these teams that unfortunately do get relegated near enough every time you start a new season. But Vladimir... His potential ability is 150, and I know already, he's already playing close to his potential ability, of course. But Vladimir, he's my left back for the Slovakian Hidden Gems list. Let's look at my right back, Roman Kratochvil. Now, Roman, he's 27 years old once again. He's playing over at Denis Lepore. He can play over at right back or at left back. Now, I've selected Roman to be my right back purely because Vladimir is my left back. Now, Roman's valued at five and a half million pounds. He's getting paid just under £11,000 a week. But once again, he's another player that has a relegation release clause within his contract. Now, Roman's potential ability is 150. Already, I know he's playing like Vladimir close to his potential ability but these are my two fullbacks guys let's see my two center backs for this for the slovakian hidden gems list michael hanuk now michael is 20 years old he's obviously playing over at dumnika now he's valued at just over a quarter of a million pounds he's getting paid just under four thousand pounds a week now michael's potential ability is 160 the only down, the only downsize for him, unfortunately, is his injury proneness. He's at 20, which obviously is not a good thing, of course. But to help you guys make sure he doesn't pick up all these injuries as quickly as regularly, as regularly, sorry, as he normally would do, click on that link up there or have a look at the video later on once this video is done. It's the training regime. And the fitness regime will hopefully be able to make sure he doesn't pick up as many injuries as possible. Now, Michael is one of two centre-backs in my team. Let's have a look at the other one. Radoslav Zabanavic. Now, Radoslav is 20 years old. He's the other centre-back as part of my uh, Slovakian Hidden Gems list. Now, he is playing over at Zelina. He's valued at £80,000. He's getting paid £4,500 a week as well. Now, Radoslav's potential ability, he is the lowest out of the whole team at 136, which is a shame, but I couldn't find another player that's not really recognisable. 
So this is the reason why we've had to go with Radislav, of course. But Radislav finishes off my defensive line. Let's have a look at my midfield line, starting with my defensive midfielder. Miroslav Kahan. Now, once again, this is another player who obviously is very well known within the Slovakian team. He's obviously represented them 51 times already. But I couldn't find a decent enough defensive midfielder who would be able to pair up or come close to Miroslav, of course. Now, Miroslav, he's playing over at Wolfsburg. He is valued at £12.5 million. Pounds, and he's getting paid £41,000 a week. Now, Miroslav's potential ability is 160. Said so he's getting close to his potential ability limit, of course. But Miroslav is the only defensive midfielder I have selected from my list. Let's have a look at the two central midfielders. Stefan Zozak. Now, Stefan, he's 17 years old. He's playing over at Rosenberg. Now, with Stefan, he's valued at £85,000. Get him paid £300 a week. Now, Stefan's potential ability is 167. So he can turn into a pretty good Weldy for Slovakian national team, of course. But Stefan's one of two central midfielders. Let's have a look at his central midfield partner. Juraj Zinig. Now, Juraj, he's 23 years old. He's already played for Slovakia four times already. But he's playing it over at Inter Bratislava. Now, he's valued at £875,000. He's getting paid just over £11,000 a week. Now, Juraj, the good thing about him is that I've not really come across him before. And obviously, doing my research and actually doing a proper scouting session on him. He's actually a really good player. He really is on this game. Now, his potential ability is 167. So, within the next few years, he could be hitting his potential limit. But... He really is a fantastic player to have in your team. But let's have a look at my attacking midfielder. And it's this man. Jan Kozak. Now Jan, he's 21 years old. He's playing over at Slavia Prague. He is an attacking midfielder. He's valued at £800,000. He's getting paid £1,600 a week. Now I can see a lot of people are probably going to be saying he doesn't look good enough. But his potential ability is 167 so he will turn into an absolute worldy of a player on this game. But Jan finishes my midfield line. Let's have a look at my last two players. The first player in my upfront position is this one. Robert Vitek. Now Robert's no stranger to the Slovakian national team. He's 19 years old. He's already had 10 caps for them. He's playing his football over at Slovan Bratislava. Now, he's valued at £1.2 million. He's getting paid £22,500 a week. Now, Vitek's potential ability is 177. So, he is going to turn into an absolutely amazing striker for the Slovakian national team. But Robert's not the only striker I've picked in this team. Let's look at my last player for the Slovakian hidden gems list. Tomas Oravec. Now, Tomas is 21 years old. He's already played for Slovakia four times and scoring three times already. Now, Tomas is playing his football over at Victoria Zizkov. Now, he's, get, he's valued at 1.9 million. He's getting paid just under £15,000. Tomas's potential ability is 170. So, like Robert. He could turn into an absolute worldie as long as you make sure that you do nurture him and turn him into an absolute beast of a player. Well, that is it, guys. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, make sure you smash a like on the video and make sure you subscribe to the channel because we're so close to 2,000 subscribers. It's amazing to see that. Well, apart from that, guys, thank you very much for giving us your time. And I hope to see each and every one of you at our next video here at TGR. That's Gaming Robo.